Hmm, where's my curling tongs? <sighs> Maybe Wait, here? Where's Fluffy took him? Is he going on a date too? And where's my pink lipstick for dates? <sighs> so, here it is. Sammy, this lipstick is for classes. Hmm. Well, I need my lipstick for dates. <sighs> Where could it be? <laughs> so you've got tons of makeup, but you can't find anything. <laughs> That's not funny, Sam. <sighs> I really need to go now. Mm hmm? Hi. Feeling sick? <sighs> okay, see you another time. The date's been canceled. So, did you dress up for nothing? Why for nothing? We can do some crafting now. Let's build a house for all your makeup! Yeah, so next time it won't take me so long to get ready. Let's go! Hey, Sue! Can we transform your chest of drawers? Oh, great idea! And... Woo! Ow! <laughs> I hope one will be enough. Sam, don't worry. We can use your chest for toys, too. Anyway, they're always just laying around. Whoopsie! Let's attach slopes to the front part. So what are you talking about? All my toys are in their places. <sighs> I was just kidding. Is our house for makeup gonna be big? Yes. You can even put some of your toys in there. The roof's ready. Let's paint the house. I wouldn't entrust you with house building. Why not? Because we need to secure the roof. And you forgot about it. No, I did not. I just postponed it. So you saved me from a mistake. You're a good friend. I'm glad I could help. Guys, write the names of your friends in the comments. And for how long you've been together. Done. Now we can finally start painting the house. Yay! Let's make it green. Or better, pink. No! Shiny. The house will be beige. Ivory, to be more precise. Cute, but why? This color provides comfort. It's perfect for a house. Guys, what color would you like the house to be? Write in the comments. I'd like a shiny house. No doubt, Sammy. So, the house looks dull. You're right. But I've got an idea. What if we draw a rainbow on it? Uh, Sammy? I got a better idea. Here. Oh, what's in there? These beautiful buttons will look amazing. <gasps> I love your idea, Sammy. Let's glue these cute buttons to our house. Guys, give a thumbs up if you like my idea, too. Here goes the red button. And the yellow goes here. So look! What's up? I made Santa buttons! <laughs> so this is where all the pink buttons are. Let's put them on the bottom drawer. We're making such an unusual house. Yes, we only need to add a few details. The coast is clear for now! Oh no! We're under attack! Do I look like a pirate? You always uncover my disguises. <laughs> I'm just very attentive. First, we need to cut the tube diagonally. And hop, done. Now we can start decorating our tube. Guys, give a thumbs up if you're as attentive as Sue. And if you never miss new videos. And make sure to hit the bell so you don't miss anything for sure. Why does our house need a telescope? <laughs> it's a chimney. Many houses have them, so will ours. Let's cut extra parts to make the chimney more neat. So what's this? Reminds me of your lipstick colors. These are bricks for the chimney, but you're right. This color is nice for a daytime look. To go to classes, for instance, and this one for a night out. A date, for example. Sammy! Stop reminding me of my failed date. I'm not happy about it at all. Come on, Sue, don't be offended. Bad dates happen, it's okay. <sighs> You're right. There wouldn't be happiness without bad moments. This means that my next date's gonna be super mega perfect. Absolutely. Also, many roofs are covered with tiles. It adds coziness as well. 
My house should be cozy too. Let's add some dark shades. Oh, Sammy, great, thanks. green our house. I thought the same. Plants always create a special atmosphere. Also, they produce the oxygen we breathe. What? How does it even work? A plant inhales CO2 and exhales oxygen. It's like us only in reverse! Right. Do you know many interesting facts about plants? Write in the comments if you know some. Now... It's way more cozy. Yay, our house for makeup is done! I only need to arrange all the things. I'll keep my eyeshadows here. Perfect. Mm, here, I'll store my makeup brushes. And here, my favorite lip glosses. Let's put this into the central drawer. Great idea! Now I'll always know where my mascara is. Guys, hit the bell and give a thumbs up if you liked our house for makeup! This house is just super comfortable! Now you can quickly find things you need! Mm-hmm. I won't rush and get nervous before dates, too. Oh. Hello? Feeling better? Yeah, sure I can meet you. See you soon. Hey, Sue. Are you having a date after all? Uh, Sammy, no time for talking. Oh, where are my red shoes? Um, well... I can only tell where your red lipstick is. <gasps> Where's my bag? Oh, Sue. <laughs> Guys, oh. give a thumbs up and... Where are my pink earrings? I put them here. And subscribe to our channel. Sammy! I'm coming! Bye, guys. Hi, guys. Today we'll make a cool practical organizer for makeup. To store everything in one place, then Cookie and Fluffy won't touch your thingies. First of all, we need a simple box. You can use a shoe box, for example. Now let's insert three cardboard pieces along the perimeter. Making the wall sturdier, that's right. Sammy, we need to make an opening in the box. Right here. Time to draw my sword from its scabbard. Be right back. Guys, be very careful working with a cutter. Let's cover our makeup organizer with bright paper. I chose this color. I don't think anyone would enjoy an ordinary box. Uh, I think I've beaten another cutting record. Wow, Sammy, that was quick. Yep, that's the kind of opening we need for the organizer. Master Sam's flawless. Now we can insert the fourth cardboard piece that fits the dimensions of this wall. Oh, should we cover everything with this paper? Right you are. But I think we deserve some magic. Shall we? Whoosh! It's done! So beautiful. For a moment I felt sad I didn't have cosmetics. Wait, it's just the beginning. Now we're going to divide the box into two parts. Insert these cardboard pieces on the sides to make the second level. I covered them with colored paper beforehand. Are we making an organizer or a multi-story house anyway? Sammy, order and comfort should be everywhere, in big houses and in small organizers. Small, eh? We had stationary houses way smaller. Don't grumble. I'm gonna give you a new task. By the way, it's coming out great! Just like our house is for stationery. We're going to need new pieces. Let's move on. So guys, we've cut out a lot of cardboard pieces. We're ready to continue building our organizer. Out of all these pieces, we're going to make drawers which will fill the organizer. Are the position of the pieces important or are they all the same? It is important. The front side should be pink, see? Let's use some magic to finish the base quicker. Oh, not bad, but it can be better. Now we're talking. Check out the result. Time to put them into our organizer. Two! I read that the first makeup bag was made in Japan. Geologists 
dated back to the ninth century. Why do they even need makeup bags then? Sammy, people have always wanted to be beautiful and neat. That's in the ninth century and today. Only now it's easier to do, of course. Our organizer will definitely help with that. Yeah, there were no YouTube channels that could help in the ninth century. So now we need four large rectangular pieces like these. Four pieces like this. Four smaller pieces. Four more pieces like these. And finally, these strips. Sue, do you know who you remind me of? Um, no. Who? A cooking blogger. We'll need four pieces like these, four smaller pieces, salt to taste. <laughs> well, then it's time to mix the ingredients. <laughs> Yeah, time to cook the dish. Right, that's why you're gonna help me, my young cook. Look, we need to take popsicle sticks and carefully make holes in them. No problem, I'm on it. Well, guys, I've glued everything. We're gonna make a flip cover. I'm going to show you how to make this kind of cover. Stick the masking tape this way. And attach the cover to the base. Now cover it with another piece of colored paper so the joint is invisible. Now let's do the same from this side. First goes the masking tape. Then goes the colored paper. I can see Sam's finishing with the sticks. He's so quick today. Anyway, we've got this flip cover. Very beautiful and easy to use. Both boxes are ready. Sue, I cut and colored the sticks, but they don't look like cosmetics. <laughs> of course not. These are the fasteners for the organizer. Let's insert the screws into these holes. Guys, remember to be careful. There, this is our fastener. Um, where's Sam? Where can Sam be? At work, of course. Great job, Sammy, just what we need. Everything for your beauty, Miss Sue. Now we need to make holes in our boxes. We'll insert our fasteners here. I've made the same holes in the base as well. Let's add a bright detail. Now connect the boxes with the base. There we go. So, couldn't we just use adhesive tape? But Sammy, we're making a practical organizer, not a kid's craft. Plus, it wouldn't look neat with adhesive tape. And the boxes couldn't move like this. Wow, it's a real transformer! Yes, yeah, Sammy, it's serious. So come on, help. Well, guys, we're getting closer to finishing our cosmetic organizer. We've set the fasteners. And this is how our boxes move. Very stylish and practical. It looks like a makeup organizer for a special agent. Cute but special agent-ish. Now we need rectangular pieces of three sizes. Time to fill the empty space of our organizer. So, do you really use this much makeup every day? It'll take an hour to apply all these things least it's like 30 hours a month which is 360 hours per year two weeks to do makeup every year sammy you're good at math but you're not that good at making conclusions <laughs> we've got another section here let's finish it now speaking of makeup sammy you know a lot of people have lots of cosmetics in their arsenal it's not that big of a deal well, I got that, judging by the capacity of this organizer. But most people just use them to a minimum. Plus, cosmetics are not just for makeup, but also skincare. I wonder if you could leave only three cosmetic items on Earth, what people would choose? I bet mascara, you use it every day. Also a lipstick for special occasions. <gasps> and face powder! Sammy, you're daydreaming. I finished making a new section in the meantime. All right, now we need a top for the organizer. You mean this? Sammy, I thought it was impossible to pull you out of your fantasy world. Yes, it's almost the last piece. It's like a crown for the organizer. It must have been made by a king, if you know what I mean. It looks perfect. I'd say royal. All right, time to glue these pieces for the decor of our organizer. Don't forget to be careful working with hot glue, guys. So, glue one piece like this each drawer. They look like soft handles for drawers! Well, you can call them that. By the way, we can glue everything twice as fast if you join me, Sammy. Once again, fair enough. Look at your makeup box. Now look at ours. 
Sammy, wait, it's not finished. Okay, now you can take a look. Makeup organizer, but it's really awesome. It looks cute thanks to the colored paper and special decorative elements. While the fasteners make it practical and roomy. Let's arrange my cosmetics into the organizer. So uh, there she goes here. Now we really need to speed it up. I think this organizer could fit any amount of cosmetics. Well, I'm sorry, but it's time to dispose of you. Wait! Um, I'll figure out how to use it. You know me. Everybody, we invite you to make this awesome makeup organizer at home. It's very practical, spacious, and stylish. You can choose any color you like. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell. I'll take the old eyeshadows away. He and need new ones anyway for this cool box. Thanks for watching, guys, and bye bye. <laughs>